Welcome all, ladies and man, ladies and here on NASCAR Heat 4, showing you how to make the best custom liveries on YouTube. Well, today we're doing the Reese's car, driven by the 29 of Kevin Harvick. Let me show you how it's done. What we're going to do, I'm going to show you how it's made. So basically, we go on the right, we go one, two, bam. It's the third one from the right. And just to show off what paint scheme it is, we've changed these to make it look uh, a little different. So you can see, oh yeah, you recognise that livery. Does that make sense? So there we go. Right. I'm now changing the livery up a bit because I've found one which is a lot cooler. So what we do, on here, at the bottom, you've got this uh, rainbow effect. Usually we're all on this one. We go on to the rainbow. Go all the way up to the orange, which is... There's this really strong red. We go one above that, and we go about the sixth one from the bottom, um, back there. You could go one brighter if you wanted to, but I like this more opaque looking orange. As for the stripe one, that's the bottom part, and that's got to be the normal standardized bright yellow. And that's the same with stripe two as well, and that just adds a lot more emphasis on that yellow it looks really good to be honest it doesn't look like a bad thing from the start if I'm fair but this part uh, on some of these he had it was just plain yellow on the car of tomorrow and this is the one I'm trying to replicate because it looks that little bit better we go to the we want to try and find a brown and we don't want too dark of, actually we do want a too dark of a brown so I was thinking more of that, but we want to go for a nice dark brown. So it's the one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it's a long way. It's about near the middle, basically. And we go to the bottom of this orange. For the 29 logo, I would love to have had this 28. Yeah. So, but he, but Kevin Harvick drives the 29 car at the time. So what we're going to do? We keep it as 29. But if you don't care about the number. Try and find some of these D's because they do look like proper NASCAR ones. So, you got the choice once again. That's the 29C looks horrid. End of. So, you got the 29B or you got the 29A. And I like the 29A if I'm honest. It's because of the uh, black outline around it, it shows off the car better than. shows off the number better when you've got that. It's The colours are very similar to the yellow which is going to be on the number. So, once again, normal opaque yellow, too dark, that's orange, <laughs> bam. As for the wheels, we go one, two, three, bam. It's the fourth one across from the left, and you've got little, little yellow uh, lug nuts. So, yeah, basically, that's the start of it all. And now we're going to go to the decals. And this is the part I'm changing, because the gateway logo looks good, and it will match some versions of it but I the car tomorrow had yellow writing on it and I think that suits it a lot better so you can go for the south point which still hides away slightly there's other ones that can just hide you can't see it for the life of you but I want to go for flex seal and that's an usual choice of delivery but a uh, choice of sponsor but because of the black outline you can see it so much clearer on the side we're not going to have any on the rear quarter, we're going to go, once again, for Flex Seal. And there it is. It's not the biggest sponsor, and I wish we could make that bigger and more in your face on the rear quarter panel, but unfortunately that's not the case. Texted, I think we're going to go keep with this uh, Flex Seal sort of theme going. And where is it? There it is. And that's how you do Kevin Harvick's Reese number 29 car. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you to see you racing in Sivri anytime soon.